we're going to the Magic Kingdom, but we had to stop and see if our favorite pianist, West, was here, and he is. And of course, I asked him if he was gonna, if he could play Million Dreams for us. So, Vivi, this one's for you. So, get ready. Shout out to my little sister, Christina. She went back, we went to, school back today. to school today. One more semester, four classes, and she's graduated. And it's weird because he plays it a little differently every time. That was probably my least favorite version that he's done. But it felt like a like bolder version of it, like deeper. Like the like he like shift he shifted all the keys down like an octave. But it was still very good. So if you ever see Wes playing piano, ask him to play it, he's the best. <laughs> Well, well, we haven't been in the parks in the past week, pretty much. And we've been with friends visiting in the parks, so we haven't been able to like do the parks how just Sarah and I do it when it's just us. But look at how beautiful it is. Full on fall, glimmering pumpkins. I can't wait till later tonight when it's dark and we can just take our time strolling Main Street and just soak in all this beauty. And it's beautiful weather out the rain. It rained a lot earlier. And it really cooled it down, so it's gonna be a really enjoyable night. The crowds look like they're a cake right now. I heard a guest say on the way in that uh, they're like 10 minute waits for like most of the rides. Sarah got three fast passes. What are we doing? We're doing some classics. Haunted Mansion, Peter Pan. Pirates. Pirates. This is gonna be a good, solid Magic Kingdom night and I, we needed this. I'm super pumped. Kinda wanna get some water. Sarah is all about the photos right now because of the skies and the rainbows all over the place tonight is just driving literally every guest wild because there was like a whole crowd of people on Main Street towards the front trying to get good pics and now Sarah's like deviating from our fast passes to try to capture this beautiful sky. This camera's not doing any justice, but I'm just so happy to be here I could cry. Um, what? Apparently, Tom Surround is like mega close because it's drained and there's Rivers proof. Of America, are you there's, okay? there's proof at how shallow Rivers of America is. It's deeper than I expected. And that it's on a truck. Yeah, we knew, but peop some people didn't believe us that it was on a track. But maybe they're doing it because maybe they're bringing it back. Oh, wait, I think you can still go on Tom Sawyer because it's like black. There's like a dam. Oh, oh yeah, and there's the other side of it over there. Very interesting. I wonder if they're gonna bring back the boat soon. But there, that it's just proves. How at least deep it is here. I thought it was shallow here. That is the time when ghosts are present, practicing their terror with ghoulish delight. Serpents and spiders, tail of a rat. Because of Sarah's awesome fast pass skills, tonight is being deemed the best way to combat the Monday blues. <laughs> and that is Ride Palooza. We got three fast passes. We're going back to back on these two. Well, I don't think our next one's like nine or something. Yeah. But small rolls, 10 minutes. I'm just going to walk up seven dwarfs. I don't care. <laughs> so we'll see how many we can get on. Them. And. Wait, the fast pass for Peter Pan's really long. It's okay. It'll go by fast. And. The school system down in Florida has gone back. Halloween parties are up. There's just been like three already, so it's like old news. It's fall, but it's hot. Run 
over across the street to Small World because when we were walking over, it said 10 minutes, and it looks like there's not a soul but all the little Small World people in the ride. Literally. Hold on. There's not a line right now. This was... This was a... Uh, this was about a 45 second wait, wouldn't you say? Wait a minute. The fireworks are going on. <laughs> Guys, I love the fireworks and it really in Fantasyland. It really is. Because they're messing as we had. Guys, we forgot to tell you something crazy that happened last week. Yeah. So, Sarah texted me, or we got a message last week from Elizabeth. one of you, Elizabeth, who we met last year at the Halloween party that we went to. She was actually the first person to ever approach us ever. in the park and say, I watch your videos. So like Elizabeth, when you watch this, just know that like you are forever in our brains and our hearts because you were the very first person, you and your mom, it was, it was Elizabeth's yeah, mom, right? Yeah, the Halloween party. And you were dressed up and it was great and you were saying how you want to do a college program and you can't wait. Fast forward a year later, almost to the date, she messaged us and says, guys, not only am I doing the college program, I checked in today to Patterson, and can you believe it or not, me and my friends, my roommates, checked into Patterson Court 5207. She's like, I could not believe. And I got chills again just now. And Sarah got chills, I got chills. We texted all of our friends from 5207. A, a girl, a cast member, making magic, met us last year, watched our videos, got to do the college program, said how much fun it looked and everything, is doing one, great enough, magical enough, and she's in our apartment. Wild. It is the most we wild thing ever. Tonight, so we, I got to show them like photos. Yeah, and they were like, that's our room, that's our furniture. <laughs> they're well, like, they, oh, that they got, got changed. Well, some of it, the table, right? The table yeah, the table so like, they were like freaking out. They're like, that's our apartment. It's so weird to see like your, you guys and you guys' stuff in there. Cool. Have a good program. I'm sure we'll see you around. I can't and go. Thank you for making the magic there. for us. You can go today. Good night's sleep. It's called a People Mover 940 followed by a fast pass to Pirates of the Caribbean, topped off with the cherry of a nice boat ride to the Grand Floridian, followed by snuggles with Eve watching a movie. Wow. Probably a Christmas movie. I'm pretty, I'm pretty blessed. I think I won the lottery. It's the least Monday. You like we haven't been on Space Mountain in forever. Comment below if this would freak you out when you were a little kid going in Space Mountain before you could go on it yourself. Okay, I love this one. It's really incredible. Mr. and Mrs. Incredible are like all lovey dovey. And he's like, he's sneaking around. But like, he's getting open and they're all happy. Tonight, 
mine I feel like would be a, the epitome of a Brookhart project night on a movie pass. Miss those days. Freddy, it's our last fast pass of the night. What time is it? 9.41. 9.41. We're hoping we can maybe get one more attraction after, but if not, we still conquered six. Six, six, six. <laughs> I just meant to like celebrate the number of attractions you've done. Not summon the devil. I am no chicken. I will not love you. Hunt down, you lily livered lover. Strike your feathers, dearie. Show up your flock. Okay, we're getting off pirates. That was the sixth attraction of the night in just three hours. We've been here. It's 9.50. We got 10 minutes of park close. We're gonna see what the wait is for Jungle Cruise. If we can get one on, get on one of those before we uh we depart for the evening. Why is Sarah making fun of me in the background? The gent. The gent. We're super pumped. You're gonna hear a lot more of those references because Matt has Hulu, so when he moved in, he checked, he logged in, and how I met your mother. Shout out to Cassie and Corey, who are big fans. Yes. Um, we can watch now all the How I Met Your Mother, which we've been deprived of since they pulled it off Netflix. Darn you, Netflix. Hey, Wong, the voice of the jungle, broadcasting on the DVC, 12 points on dial. If you're within the sound of my voice, you are listening to Hey, Wong, Airways, on the DVC. DVC? Disney Vacation Club to the forest. The jungle. What am I? The forest cruise. Hi, camera. How's it going? His name is George. Everyone say hi, George. Hi, George. Yeah, me and him have a very constricting relationship. I really like to spray people that have cameras and iPhones. Skipper Travis gave us a hard time the entire time for having cameras out and recording it, but it was all in good fun. It was a really good um, journey. <laughs> good. Skipper. Yeah. Not a good boat. <laughs> yeah, not a good boat. They were not picking up when he was throwing down. I was, was loving his jokes. New stuff he was throwing him. geeky stuff out there, new stuff, probably stuff he came up with. I was loving it. Yeah. Loving it. He made a, chem a periodic table of elements joke that was just hilarious. So, if you ever on the, on the Jungle Cruise and get Skipper Travis, get ready because it's going to be a good one. <laughs> Are you sleepy or something, little, little girl? She is so dead weighted right now. Within that time of me saying that, her eyes are closed. <laughs> it's been time. It is. I'm very tired. We're watching another Christmas movie. It's the holiday season. Dickory down. It's good to be, to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>